right, Nick, so I figured I could make this video a lot faster than I could text this, text this back and forth, but here's basically what that player is doing. In his takeaway, the face is pointing straight down to the ground, okay? So when you think about that, to do that, the golfer would have to be internally rotating his trail shoulder, which is gonna be a steepening move of the shaft. Because that face is pointing down to the ground so long, and that right shoulder is internally rotated, he basically gets the shaft vertical and he has a short backswing. So that's a deadly combination. For the club to be able to shallow, we either A, have to have more external rotation of the shoulder, or we have to lengthen out the swing so that there is enough time for the club to shallow on the downswing. He's probably not gonna lengthen his swing. So what I suggest is feeling some external rotation of this trail shoulder on the backswing, which is basically gonna be getting the toe in a more vertical position at the start of the takeaway. So from there, as he goes external at the top, the club, even though it's still gonna be short, the club is gonna be less vertical and a little bit more in this laid off kind of position, which gives him kind of a head start of having a shallower downswing. Now, because his downswing is not shallow and it's steep and short, he basically stalls all his body's rotation in an effort to buy time for the club to get back inside his hands here. But because he turned off all that rotation, it's too late. The club just gonna keep going and you see that kind of flip there. So my recommendation or how I would fix that golfer is I would get the toe working more vertical, which is gonna be more external rotation of this trail shoulder. It's gonna get the club more in sort of a laid off kind of position. On the way down, the club will be shallower and his response to that will be to continue to pivot, to keep putting force on the back of that handle around in a circle like this. Hope that makes sense. Text me if you have any questions.